Hey, good morning. Chatty Dad One here with you today. Crocodile flesh eating drug reportedly found in Canada. What do you know? This is from the Huffington Post Canada. Yep, yeah, the stuff is spreading like wildfire. There's, uh, you know, more and more reports of these people that are heroin users. They think that they've been using heroin, and it turns out that they, uh, you know, have this crocodile. Um, became popular in Russia due to a heroin shortage. That's funny because they had the heroin fields in Afghanistan. The drug is cheap, roughly one-tenth the cost of heroin. It's made from coating tablets combined with substances like gasoline, paint thinner, or lighter fluid. Average life expectancy for a crocodile addict is less than two years. Like I said, this is a, uh, in my opinion, this is a, an attack. Here's uh, here's some more for you. First cons confirmed case of crocodile in the United States was observed over a year ago, according to a new report. It's about the time we started hearing about the Russians coming over. Now, they don't know of anybody making the stuff. They don't know of anybody selling the stuff. But... These people that have been coming in have been reporting that they've been shooting up heroin. So, you know, here we go. It's, it, it continues, and it will continue to do so. This is the first part of their, their wave. To get rid of all these drug addicts and, and uh, drug users like this. They're going to wipe them out. They're going to think they're doing heroin. They're not going to know the difference till they got to show up to the ER with their freaking arm falling off. Hope everybody's well. This is Chatty Dad 1. God bless. Good luck. Over and out. Never give up your guns. Second Amendment's keeping us safe so far. Over and out.